Today, Kevin and I are trying the Hostess Red Velvet Cupcakes. These are limited edition. They are out for Valentine's Day. Everyone has been recommending uh, that I try these, and so I didn't want to name any names. It's a long list of people. Thank you to each one of you that recommended these. I really appreciate them. I appreciate it. These were $2 at Big Lots. And then we went to Walmart immediately after, and they were $2.99. So Walmart was charging a dollar more than Big Lots. And um, I just think that's a shame. You know, there's, so if you have a Big Lots around you, I would check there first. They are 170 calories a cake. Oh, he's making sure I open the box right because I'm not paying attention. There are 170 calories a cake. And there are eight cakes in the box. It's supposed to be, oh, it's and awesome. I'm going to be honest, these have had horrible reviews. Every well, they people haven't necessarily said they're bad. They've just said that uh, they if you're going in expecting red velvet, then you're disappointed. So, uh, so these are the packages. They're all individually wrapped. Um, How many calories are these? 170? 170. And I'm going to, why don't you hold it up and then I'll half it and show the. Show the insides. Yeah. No, that, that actually has a lot more cream in it than I mm -hmm. thought it would. Okay. You can tell they squirted the cream in from the top. Oh, yeah, they did. It feels dry just by just by hand. It feels kind of dry. I think it's it's not though. No. It's moist. It's a, it's a spongy. I don't know that I like that flavor though. That doesn't taste like red velvet at all. That tastes like just a regular devil's food cake, like a like the bitter chocolate devil's food cake. Mm-hmm. With not a good frosting. I mean, normally the frosting is a good vanilla flavor. That's kind of, I don't know, kind of a funky flavor. It like reminds it. me of um, when you buy cupcakes at, uh, and nothing, I'm not speaking bad about it at all because I actually think it's okay. Um, it reminds me when you buy cupcakes at Walmart, kind of what they <laughs> those taste like, the cupcakes. And just, you probably don't get that at all, Dan. No, I just don't think it tastes like anything. It tastes like a devil's food cake with no frosting on it. That's what it tastes like to me. I don't think it's bad. I think if you if you it's see a, them, uh, if you see them and you like Hostess cupcakes, or your kid has a party, uh, you could pick up uh, two or three boxes of those, and the kids are going to be happy because they're different yeah. colored cupcakes. I personally, um, I wouldn't buy them again. But I don't think they're bad. I don't think they, they don't taste like red velvet. Though. No, there's no red velvet at all. No. I would rather just have the regular traditional chocolate cupcake, though. This yeah. one's This one's, like I said, it's devil's food cake. I'd rather have just a traditional cupcake. Right. This one, that one right there. Actually, <laughs> I like the, the ho-ho's better. But oh, yeah, those are good, too. Anyway. Yeah. So, anyway, we found them, and uh, they won't get wasted, trust me. They will get eaten by me, at least. Uh, but I probably won't go out and buy any more. So thanks for watching.